Okay, I'm back doing the windshield. As this windshield here, this molding, is a part of the windshield. Now to cut that out, it's very hard to do. Um, especially with wire or that cutter. So what I did was I took it to a glass company and they used a uh, electric uh, cutters. 20 bucks and they cut out the windshield from the inside. Right around the whole inside of the uh, car. Which was taken out already. Which is this one here. See the molding is still on there. And I just cleaned it up all the uh, your thing. See it's got that lip right there which is very hard to cut it out. It cracks more once it's cracked. Originally. And there's the windshield they just took. This is quite thick. See I'm just peeling it away with the exacto knife all the way around. Now I'm just getting my uh, tubes of urethane ready. But anyway, there's the uh, the nozzle and I cut the inside to one half inch because that's that's a piece of the old urethane and it is around a half inch so I'm going to be putting a half inch bead all the way around. Okay I'm putting the caulking on now which there's a time limit of about 15 minutes for this and you gotta let this uh, set for about 12 hours after you do your windshield. Right now I'm on the third tube. This is where two tubes have gotten it so far. <laughs> Zoom it in there. Okay, do a quick video of this and then shut it off. Not to get this urethane on the camera. That would mean so good on the lens. <laughs> okay, we'll be back. <laughs> Push the, we put the window into place now. I'm just pushing down so the urethane catches everywhere. You just have to go along and push it down. Some people use a hammer, but I'm not using a hammer. <laughs> I'm just going along pushing. You can actually see it on the top if, if you're pushing it down, because the, the plastic will meet the, uh, the body. And there is a slight trick to how to put this in. You have to put the window up a bit and slide it in, because it catches right here. Right there on each side. So just a little bit up and then slide it in. much do you see oozing out there? Very much. Mm. There you can see the caulking right there. The urethane. It's not oozing out much. When I'm pushing down can you see it moving at all? Yeah? And that's what you're trying to seal more when you're by pushing it down. But there's a there's a good half inch bead all the way around. I don't think you can go less than half an inch. So I used about two and a half of those tubes at 310 milliliters. So that's uh, 600, 750 milliliters of urethane. And I think that that's about the minimum you can go. That's. Well, the windshield's in. I'm just going to let it dry overnight. I took the review mirror off of this one here. And this is a uh, four-door uh, Sunfire, which the windshield is the same as a four-door Cavalier. Uh, 95 to 2005. And... Uh, a two-door Sunfire is the same as a two-door Cavalier, 95 to 2005 the windshield fits.